Flight continuing on Starship. As a reminder, this is a test flight to a 10 kilometer altitude. Engine number three shut down on time as planned. We're continuing to climb on two engines. minutes we are handing off to the LOX tank we are beginning to flip to horizontal and the white cloud the plume you were seeing was intentional that is a liquid oxygen dump we've now transitioned to horizontal and beginning the subsonic test portion of the flight where we check out the aft and the forward flaps to hold the vehicle stability as we descend back to the landing pad plus five and a half minutes starship continuing the subsonic descent using the forward and aft flaps to control its attitude as we come back down to the landing pad everything continuing to go well in this portion of flight Six minutes, 10 seconds into flight. We're down beneath one and a half kilometers. We're preparing to restart two engines, flip the vehicle vertical, then transition to one engine for the landing burn. Transition the engines to the landing propellant tanks. 
The subsonic reentry looked very good and stable like we saw again last December, so we've got a lot of good data on flap control. And again, we've just got to work on that landing a little bit. But second time we've flown Starship in this configuration, we've got a lot of good data and the primary objective to demonstrate control of the vehicle in the subsonic reentry uh, looked to be very good and we will take a lot out of that. And with that, we're going to wrap up today's webcast. Thanks for logging on and watching, and we'll be back with another Starship in the near future.